Hello, my beauty family! Welcome back to my channel. For those who are new, hi, my name is Victoria, and I'm here to share with you my passion about makeup and skincare. So, if you still haven't joined my family, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you will be notified about my future videos. Also, follow me on Instagram, and I have a TikTok account with the same user. Me. Guys, you have no idea how long it took me to finally sit down and film this video. Probably like uh, four months ago, I purchased one item that I wanted to try so badly just because I was wearing a mask and I felt like my pores just got so crazy. They got worse and I know this and I felt this. So I started to look for some kind of treatment. I was using a lot of exfoliants. I started using the retinol and I feel like for some time I forgot about this item. But now when I was going through my skincare stuff and you know, stuff that I got and I've never used and there's like a bunch of this, okay. Anyway, I found those peace out pore strips and I'm like, you know what? Let's give them a shot. You know, it's just, it's been a while, but you know, I'll give it a shot. Guys, if you are like me, struggling with big open pores or with the blackheads, and you are realizing that mask mandate just made everything like 10 times worse, I'm here for you, okay? We're gonna check out this item from Peace Out. I'm so, so curious how it's gonna work. So we're getting this packaging for nose strips and for pore strips. And basically what it is, this is oil absorbing pore treatment strips that retails for $19. So at the moment when I'm filming this video, this product is out of stock at Sephora. And whoa guys, that's impressive. So I'm gonna show you my besties here. And here they are. As you can tell, I like this brand. Not everything works for me the best. But if you still haven't checked out those acne healing dots, guys, I just you're missing so much. If you have acne, if you have white heads, come on. Those acne healing dots include salicylic acid, they include aloe vera and vitamin A. So basically they are soaking out all that gross stuff and they are healing everything. They are healing your skin, they are healing your wound. I love them so much. I'm using them lately really often just because, okay, I need to start eating better because I'm eating a lot of garbage. All junk that I eat, you can definitely see over here. Also, I've been trying new supplements, so everything is just, you know, everything that's going on in my face basically is happening because, you know, I've been trying new things and lately I've been eating not really healthy. But anyway, this gives me opportunity to try something like that and to recommend this to you guys if you're struggling with something like that. Also, I want to mention this piece out puffy eyes. So those are under eye patches. They have caffeine, they have niacinamide and also hyaluronic acid. So caffeine usually does great job in deep puffing. Niacinamide is getting rid of hyperpigmentation, blemishes and stuff like that. And hyaluronic acid, as you guys all know it's for hydration it's a humectant so basically everything that we need for delivering good good ingredients under our eyes uh, literally everything is here i can definitely tell that this one is a short-term treatment so i'm kind of thinking that probably that's gonna have the same vibe just because i think it's gonna take care of some stuff it's just not gonna be my stable routine like you know everyday tapish routine because it's like too much but I'm really excited. So what we're gonna do today, I'm filming really late. So what we're gonna do, I'm gonna explain you guys what it is. Why did I pick this? What's the benefit for your skin from this, guys? Also, I'm gonna wash my face. I'm gonna come back to you. We're gonna apply those strips. I'll see how they work. I will sleep over with those strips. And then I'm gonna wake up. I'm gonna show you how everything looks. I'm sure everything is gonna look so gross. So that's gonna be probably one of the grossest videos I have on my channel. Hands down. Just your breath is not um, pretty. Hopefully I will not have any irritation. So you'll definitely know how sensitive skin is reacting to this type of treatment. Also, I'm gonna apply makeup after this. It's gonna be tomorrow. And I'm gonna explain you, do I feel any difference? Do I think that, you know, those strips help me with my texture? Or maybe I will not feel any difference, who knows? Anyway, that's why I'm here, that's what we're gonna check out today. So let's jump into checking out the ingredients list, checking out what's so beneficial in those strips for our skin, and let's try them on. Guys, you can definitely tell what problems I have in my life, right? Based on this. 
Okay guys, so first of all, I'm kind of concerned. Those strips are supposed to help to get rid of excess of oil. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna help quite a bit with my blackheads and with my, you know, pores that I literally got twice as big because of the mask situation. So this would be good for oily combo or normal skin. The product is vegan, it's hypoallergenic and also it contains retinol. And I'm gonna jump into this with details a little bit later. So those strips contain hydrochloric technology that's supposed to lift away dirt dead skin cells basically from within your pores and hydrocolloid bandages are flexible bandages made of water retracting material attached to a thin plastic film and hydrocolloids were originally designed to be used for ulcers and eventually they become really, really popular especially with treating acne and especially in Asia so what those strips are gonna do for us first of all they're gonna protect the wound against rubbing and scratching while we have those strips on they're gonna prevent water from evaporating and also it's gonna prevent drying of the wound and our skin is gonna heal faster so the whole concept is about taking all that bad stuff out like soaking out the bad stuff and then helping the pores to get tighter and smaller pores can't disappear from our face I know it can be a little bit frustrating but we can minimize the appearance of pores we can make them look smaller and there are a lot of exfoliants that can help with this especially chemical exfoliants I love chemical exfoliants a lot and I feel like Paolo's Choice does the job really, really nicely it's really hyped I'm sure guys you've heard about this and I want to mention that water attracting material is usually made of carboxymethyl cellulose gelatin or pectin and when I looked here at our ingredients list we have here cellulose gum so if you will read this you definitely can recognize that's what that water attracting material made of so that's gonna basically suck all the fluid of the wound of our pores we will see that it's gonna change the color from transparent to white I'm kind of familiar with this just because I've been using those for so long and it's basically kind of similar idea oh also I want to mention that it's gluten-free and cruelty free okay next what's really important we have here vitamin a and you know guys that retinol basically is a derivative of vitamin a so what it does for our skin it minimizes the appearance of pores it goes deep into our skin it's healing skin and i feel like knowing that those strips contain retinol just make everything so much better and you know i kind of feel like I know what to expect just because retinol usually dry in our skin so I probably will need some hydration after I think I'm gonna give my skin a little bit of a break after taking those off tomorrow and before applying makeup just to make sure my skin is you know it's not stressed out anymore it just you know looks healthy glowy so we can create some look after also we have here dmae so this is a compound that people believe can positively affect even your mood which is like crazy apparently it can improve brain function but here specifically in those strips we're talking about basically benefits for aging skin so what this is gonna do here it's supposed to visibly shrink enlarged pores and make our skin look firm and smooth so i'm really excited guys actually about this i know it's gonna be gross i just i'm ready for this i hope you guys are ready too so we have four packs here and you basically can leave it on your skin from four to six hours you can leave it overnight and as i already mentioned i'm gonna leave it per night so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go and wash my face wash my makeup and let's check them out i'm kind of curious to see how everything's gonna look in the morning time probably really gross but i'm gonna show you everything i'm gonna tell you how do i feel how does my skin feel so yeah let me go and wash my face and i'll be right back okay guys so i washed my face i didn't apply any serums nothing no moisturizer absolutely nothing my face is kind of still red stressed out from cleansing but let's open this package and here's what's inside we have no strip and basically a strip for our forehead so i'm gonna grab first this strip for our forehead and i'm gonna place it right on the top of my eyebrows you need to make sure that your skin is dry because if it's not then those strips are not gonna stick nicely and here's the nose strip such a weird weird feeling i just hope i will not you know accidentally take this off when i will be sleeping so i'm trying to make sure there is no air 
in between. Well, guys, that's the first part of the video. So yeah, I'm gonna go to sleep, and as soon as I will wake up, I'll show you how everything looks, and I'll let you know how do I feel about this. So yeah, guys, basically, I'll see you in a few seconds with the overnight result. Okay, guys, so I literally just woke up, so excuse my morning voice, but here we are. I'm about to take those strips off. So let me tell you a few words about this. First of all, like you barely see any liquid or anything going on here. You see white spots over here on my nose and there's barely something, so I'm kind of confused what's going on. Either my skin is too dry or maybe I'm just exfoliating enough and there is no excess oil, but I have blackheads and it's not quite helping with them. Anyway, it started to smell really bad and that's understandable. Usually retinol can give kind of like a scent. So let's take this off and let's see. Oh, oh my, that hurts like hell. All right, our forehead is free. That's intense. Okay, so actually just randomly it pulled out of my nose few things. Very randomly, I don't know, like you can tell there's like red spots. It means that from those spots it pulled like stuff from my nose. It looks so gross, but I expected a little bit more. And based on that fact that my forehead strip is literally clean, I'm like, what's the point? But anyway, I'm gonna let my skin heal and I'm gonna come back to you with full face of makeup and with my final opinion about this peace out pores strips. Okay guys, so I'm back and let me finally tell you a few things about those peace out pore strips and would I actually recommend you guys picking this up or should you skip it and there is no point for you getting this. So I wait a few hours before actually applying makeup just because I wanted to give my skin a little bit of a break and you know what, when I was applying my makeup I noticed that my nose is a little bit smoother than usually. I haven't noticed any irritation which is really, really good so it means that it can fit sensitive skin as well. So from what I got here, uh, as I told you guys before, it pulled a little bit of a stuff from my nose, but this strip that was on my forehead is literally clean. So the reason why it's happened is actually not because those strips are bad or something. First of all, my skin is really, really dry. And second of all, I'm exfoliating very, very often. So the reason why I'm doing this is because when you have dry skin, it's really hard for you to get that glowy look you know healthy look it's so so hard if you have dry skin you probably feel me like feel my pain so i need to exfoliate i need to make sure that my skin has a lot of hydration after and i'm using retinol so i think all of those things and good skincare routine made a big influence on the results from those pore strips or should I say lack of the results. I know that my nose has a lot of blackheads. I got a little bit out. I feel like with using those strips, I will have benefits just from the nose strips. So maybe I will use all of those strips for my nose. That's pretty much all I think I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try apply one time this strip on my chin because it gets hit with pimples sometimes based on the nutrition factor. But let me help you to figure it out. Do you need those strips? First of all, I think those are good strips. And if you have oily or combination skin, I feel like you will benefit from those strips way more than I did. And let's say you're not exfoliating, you don't have like a stable skincare routine and you're still trying, you need something that's gonna work like way faster, like overnight type of thing. I think you should check this out. But if you have dry skin or you have amazing skincare routine, you don't need this. Like, you just literally don't need this. Don't expect any magic from any skincare product you're using one time. Uh, those strips, yes, they pull out excess of oil, they pull out like dry skin, stuff like that, but they're not gonna make any miracle on your face. Better just keep exfoliating your skin, find good exfoliant that would work for your type of skin. That's my suggestion for you guys. And if you're not sure what type of exfoliant fits your skin and you don't know for sure, are you sensitive, you're not sensitive, what type of skin do you have, there are always people around that know more. You can even type questions under this video. I'll try to do my best to answer them. And yeah, I feel like $19, you can give it a shot. It's definitely not a bad product. And the result you will get from those strips depend on what type of skin do you have and how good are you treating your skin. 
So yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. I hope it was helpful for you guys. I definitely got what I wanted. I checked those out. I slept with them. Definitely can tell you in the morning time, those strips don't smell good, but they definitely work. So if you want to check them out, feel free to do this. Also, I want to mention that this video is not sponsored in any way. I got them a long time ago and I wanted to try them for so long just because I really, really love those acne patches. Okay, I use them all the time and I know that they don't quite work overnight but they definitely minimize the damage to my skin and they help me to get rid of a lot of pimples and even get rid of that hyperpigmentation and that you know dark spot that we have usually after having acne or just you know random pimples so yeah thank you for staying with me today don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you still haven't i will be really happy to have you guys in my youtube family also don't forget to let me know how do you feel about treatments like that have you tried this are you planning purchasing this let me know in the comments down below i really really appreciate your opinion guys like always i will see you all in my next video love you all very much bye